I really appreciate Frank Ocean's lyrical style. I appreciate the way that he can kind of draw you into this personal space, but it's still lyrical. It's almost poetic, in a way, but it's very personal at the same time. When I first started getting into the business, a young woman in a music game that was mostly men, I did feel inadequate. For me, doing a show, the excitement of singing live, and the possibility that you're not gonna be perfect, that's the thrill of it. When I was first learning songs, I'd have a favorite song, and I'd take the chords and twist them around. I'd learn the chords and then play them backward. That was my first experimenting with writing a song. Some of the greatest artists did their best work when they got political. I always want to stay focused on who I am, even as I'm discovering who I am. I really like to live my life in a low-key fashion. I'd rather believe in my own choice and see it all go wrong than do something I'm not fully convinced of and later feel guilty about it. My mixed race background made me a broad person, able to relate to different cultures. But any woman of color, even a mixed color, is seen as black in America, so that's how I regard myself. We have the potential to help people out of poverty, out of disease, out of slavery and out of conflict. Too often, we turn the other way because we think there's nothing we can do. If I want to be alone, some place I can write, I can read, I can pray, I can cry, I can do whatever I want, I go to the bathroom. What breaks my heart is suffering of any kind. Too often, our world is divisive and cruel where it needs to be uniting and loving. I was tired and I had overworked myself and burnt myself out. So I went to Egypt by myself, when I saw what was built there. It made me understand how powerful we are, that we can create anything, and I felt like I needed to create things that were timeless too. The element of fire to me is very powerful because of what it symbolizes. How it symbolizes a strength. It symbolizes something that's unstoppable. You can't get through it, you know. When I had nothing else, I had my mother and the piano. And you know what? They were all I needed. 